right, so it's um, day two of my video blogs of um, what I'm eating in a day. And I kicked it off yesterday with um, my first shot of MCT oil and with actually one of my more recent daily cups of coffee. So I'm doing today, I actually went out to um, an Indian store and we picked up some ghee that was suggested to me. Um, it doesn't say if it's culture or not, I actually I'm just doing, trying to do some more research on it, but I did pick some up because we just weren't going to have time to make some right away. And I did want to try it out, so. The oils. It's just um, black coffee with some ghee and some MCT oil. I did half a, I did a whole teaspoon this time instead of a whole tablespoon, so. This will be my, you know, breakfast for the day and drink this and figure out you know, the next time I'm hungry or so. First, uh, ghee coffee. Mm. I don't, um, like how it's separated so much. So even though I don't actually like cream in my coffee so much, I think next time I would put a little bit of the whole milk in it to help um, a little bit better. It's basically like oil on top of my coffee. I'm having a little bit of a hard time adjusting to like so much oil in my diet. Um, actually, I'm not really a huge butter or bacon fan, to be 100% honest. So it's a little bit of an adjustment, but I'll drink this up. Like I said, this will be my breakfast and I'll see where, you know, where it takes me to. I'll check in later when I'm hungry. It's actually a little later than I usually eat. This is um, 2.55, so um, yeah, I guess I'll check in later. Actually, I, I picked it like the perfect day or week or whatever to do this because, you know, it's, this stuff's clearly, it's just not, it's keeping me sustained. I'm not very hungry and today's actually Taco Thursday, so like I'm not, I'm probably not gonna eat my tacos until way later. Alrighty, so it's about 8.30 now. And I'm checking in. I'm gonna um, get my dinner together. I'm doing taco salad tonight with spinach. And um, I made taco meat, so I'm <laughs> drinking my kombucha. And again, like I said, this is um, home brewed stuff, and I let it get pretty sour. This is about at the um, 10, 9 to 10 day mark. Sometimes a little, it depends on the temperature and everything but um yeah I drank it before meals about 20 minutes or so before meals the first meal was the coffee at about three I think it's 8 30 so five and a half hours you know pretty good I guess but I still like eating better um I'll stick with it for the throughout the rest of the week though and you know I guess I'll be doing kind of one actual meal a day but um yeah when taco salad's ready I'll check back in with everyone Okay, so I'm back with dinner time. Got a big salad. Avocado, spinach, um, tomato, scallion, um, onion, the say tomato. Um, I have taco meat with some like fake Doritos I made with like cheese. I made them this time, they didn't come out as good as the last time I did. We didn't use the best cheese. It's like Crystal Farms or something like that. Um, so they didn't hold together as well, but I got my buddy over here and had to um, hide from him when I have meat because he'll try to eat it. So I won't show it to you, but I do have meat to go with this. Um, 16 net carbs, um, 1,000 calories, uh, 75 grams of fat, and 66 grams of protein. So, you know, for one meal, it's Putting all of the macros where I need them. Um, so yeah, taco salad. And this will probably be the last entry because like I said, this is um, drinking that coffee in the morning. It's very, very filling and it's strange. I feel like I really should be hungrier than really what I am. But like I said, it's nine o'clock now. This will be my meal of the day. Um, I don't know, check in tomorrow. Bye guys.